Uh, well, my name is Salim Yamal Al Amri, and today I'm going to present to you investigate the capacitive interwinding response of power transformer. This presentation outlines is introduction to the power transformer and the measurement method we use. Uh, also, we show the measurement connection result. You see the findings. We have measurement transfer function and RFC circuit discussion, and we conclude the findings. Transformer is an important unit in a power system and operating in a higher demands and other aspects can cause a deterioration of the power transformer reliability. So this, this deterioration is called a transformer aging. Transformer aging process caused by uh, certain factors. We believe that um, temperature and moisture content are the main causes of the transformer aging. So this study conducted to investigate the transformer egging process. So three, there are actually several tests available to diagnose the transformer condition, such as dissolved gas analysis, frequency frequency domain spectroscopy. However, we we believe that, and we see in some literatures, frequency response analysis found it to be the best method to diagnose transformer uh, mechanical condition and uh, also other uh, other uh, failures in the transformer. If RA is sensitive to change of temperature, moisture content, moisture content and uh, transformer oil deterioration also. The measurement conducted actually on an actual 5 kVA uh, transformer before egging in a new condition and after 14 days of Operating and after uh, 28 days of aging, almost one month. This study proposed an investigation using capacitive interwinding test configuration, which has not been explored actually before. Also, present an actual FRA measurement on a transformer which is subjected to an accelerated of aging process in a laboratory. Beside an actual measurement, frequency response were simulated using transfer function and RLC circuit. Both transfer function and RLC circuit are first time proposed in this paper as an alternative to obtain the frequency response. Compare between these three case studies, measurement, I mean measurement and uh, transfer function, RLC circuit, were conducted in order to understand more, to understand the occurrence of the mid-frequency oscillation, the affected part in a capacitive interwinding process. This study uh, objective to investigate the factors which affecting the mid-frequency oscillation of the response. Measurement configuration refers to the connection between winding terminals and FRA equipment. There are four uh, measurement connection, which is open, short, capacitive, and inductive interwinding. In this uh, study, we use capacitive interwinding. How the measurement? Actually, V reference is a small AC injecting small AC signal to one end of a winding measure the response at one end of another winding of the same phase. This test configuration is function to check the response due to the influence of the space between the windings in the particular phase. Results, you can see the results now of actual measurement, transfer function, and of a RLC circuit. We want to show the same result from actual measurement and from the simulation part. This is actually the actual uh, measurement from the actual transformer. This is from the transfer function and this is from the RLC circuit. You can clearly see the part affected mid-frequency oscillation 
the explosion here in this part and the drop in the phase response. It's also clearly shown here in the transfer function. The same magnitude change from the actual measurement and it is also there in the RLC circuit. Well, this is this formula represents the transfer function of the uh, response. So this is for low frequency. This is mid frequency region. This is high frequency region. We cannot stay here in the table. There is no change before and after egging process. There is no change in the uh, in the natural frequency of A and B. Values remain the same. However. Uh, damping A and damping B reduces uh, the values has been reduces. So, a relationship has been observed with, uh, between the value of natural frequency and the damping effect that can be used for further information for better interpretation of the unit frequency oscillation result. Based on the transfer function, the value of the damping is control the mid frequency oscillation. It's observed that decreases of damping value cause this explosion in the oscillation magnitude. In general, it's, uh, it's believed that damping factors might have a relationship with the moisture content and temperature and oil quality, which are the contributors to the egging process of the transformer. This is a basic uh, RLC circuit represent the transformer has an RLC in parallel and in series. We can see in this table this is the setup uh, for the uh, to to represent the uh, actual uh, frequency response and we see that uh, imaginary and real capacitance will change when the when the egging process. Uh, occurred. So before egging, this is the setup. Well, we see that after 14 days of the egging and after uh, 28 days of egging, when we change the capacitance values, uh, real and imaginary part, we can represent the actual measurement. So a circuit model actually describes an electrical behavior of a transformer's capacitance interwinding frequency response. So with this approach, the effect of capacitance on the mid-frequency oscillation can be investigated. In this case, a capacitance is considered as a complex capacitance to observe the influence of the real and imaginary components. Such real and imaginary capacitance can also influence the frequency response. As a conclusion to this study, investigate the transformer egging process using frequency response analysis with capacitive interwinding test configuration. Frequency response analysis measurement was taken from an actual 5 kV area to single phase transformer. This study also demonstrated a simulation using transfer function RLC circuit from, for faster understanding of the effect of transformer egging on, on its frequency response. It is usually to understand which element responsible for which certain frequency region and this shape, the shape of the response finding shows that damping in the transfer function and real and imaginary capacitance in a developed circuit are controlling the mid-frequency oscillation are responsible for the explosion of the mid-frequency oscillation and it's believed that these parameters means damping and in transfer function are real and real capacitance and imaginary capacitance in RFC circuit are representing the change of mid frequency oscillation. According to the theory, change of winding capacitance is due to increases of moisture content and temperature. Further investigation is recommended on the on the transformer aging process using FRA and capacitive interwinding for more understanding. Thank you so much for watching this video presentation.